for you and your handsome boy, Larch. Look at that fleece. There's you guys. I gotta count lambs. And there's Susan filming me, filming you. Now, this year's mother is Holly, the yo that I uh, just tagged and put iodine on in the last video. This is her half-bred daughter with her three-quarter bred ram lamb who's feeling slightly stuck under the tree, just the way he's lying. Still a baby. There we go. Up and at him. Good mama. Doing well? Yeah. Over here is just a bit with her daughter Loverly Bit, the oldest of the flock of lambs at the moment. <coughs> I sold his, her mother, her father, sold her father, but before it went to the new owners. I um, put a few yo's to, uh, to uh, before he left, and the only one that got in lamb was just a bit, with beautiful yo lamb, loverly bit. I'm very, very pleased with how loverly bits turned out. Really nice, straight legs in the front, very nice, and then Got a nice long body, very nice long body, very well marked, and a nice pair of back legs as well. She doesn't fall down on her pasterns like so many sheep do. But I've been breeding for good pasterns for years now. How are you? with your beautiful lamb. <laughs> yeah. A loverly lo you lamb. <laughs> now, gotta go check on these ones over here. You can see the grass is still very lush in the orchard, plenty of it in it.
She's not letting me close to her lambs. Very protective, but they're looking really good. A very loud cow in the neighboring field. So they're doing very well, look very nice. Ram, both ram lambs. And then this yo with her lamb, her yo lamb. Ooh, I gave it a fright. All looking well with a loud cow as neighbor. An itchy back. You're very loud neighbors. Very loud neighbors. So all looking well. These are the newest lambs. Oh, the males I tag on the left and the females on the right, if I remember. <laughs> 